Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Sherm City here to let y'all know that the Boston Celtics will not do good next year in the NBA. They'll make the playoffs. They'll probably get that third or fourth seed, probably win a playoff round and get put out in the second round in either six or seven. And the reason I'm saying this is because the Boston Celtics just got rid of their heart and soul off the bench in Grant Williams. And they also traded Marcus Smart, who was the heart and soul of that team. And when you get rid of two players who's the heart and soul, you lose your identity. Because Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown are front runners and they're frauds. They will never get it done. They don't know how to win. And they don't know how to keep their composure. And I'm letting y'all know now that the Boston Celtics will never make the NBA Finals with them two guys again. And I really want to say that it all happened when they exposed the Mecha Udoka. They should have kept that silent, but they didn't because they tried to save that woman's job in her marriage. And that's the curse that Boston's going to have to have for the next 15 years. So you heard it here from Sherm City that the Boston Celtics will not do good next year and from here on out. Both of them players, Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown, going to have to prove something to me that they can win as a tandem together. And I'm letting y'all know they're not going to do it because both of them players don't really know how to win. They're both me first, shoot, 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 then pass, step back, and shoot. And you're going to see a lot of turmoil happening in Boston over the next three to five years with them two players. And I see one of them either being traded or signing with another team during free agency. And you heard it here first from Serum City that the Boston Celtics will not do good from here on out.